You are looking at what's left of a condo that caught fire a couple of weeks ago. Most of the roof is missing. You can see a lot of damage here. Well, today we're hearing from a woman who was rescued from this fire, as well as the people who helped save her life. And I felt as though I needed to hang up with the operator and call my mom because I wanted to tell her that I loved her one last time because I didn't know if I was going to make it. 19-year-old Brooklyn Castellanos huddled in the bathroom with her roommate and boyfriend as flames tore through the Peoria condo on 107th Avenue in Northern. That's what's left of the condo after the three became trapped. Fire blocked the exit. Smoke filled the home. I knew that we had to get help right away because we weren't going to be help ourselves at this point. Castellanos called 911 to report the fire. Then she called her mother and father, a Peoria firefighter, who she said stay with the phone. A few seconds later, I was, I was out. I don't remember anything after that except for somebody told me I was going to be okay. And then about eight hours later, I woke up in the hospital. Crews had to battle fierce flames to get the three teens out but were able to pull them out. Officials say all without pulses and considered dead. The, the chances were so low and I, I knew, but I just, I, all I could do was pray, you know, as hard as I could and, and um, that everything goes well and that my daughter makes it and she <coughs> uses her wit and she's a survivor. The teens all survived and are doing well in recovery. And today, Brooklyn and her family had a chance to thank the first responders who saved her life. Every city that was involved that, that came together to save my daughter's life, I, I just can't, I can't tell you how grateful I am. Brooklyn is a nursing student at ASU, says the experience has made her want to give back even more. She hopes to start volunteering. Officials say the fire was accidental, the cause still under investigation.